Ricardo, Rick. Yeah, Rick was pretty great. Before my first meeting, I was so, so nervous. Um, I was really stiff because, you know, I was just like, like still in more of like an academic setting mindset. I didn't really know what to expect and I didn't really know what that relationship was supposed to be like. My mentor, Rick, also helped me a lot because he really made sure that I knew exactly what future employers were looking for from, you know, first-hand experience of going through resumes and interviewing people. And he really put an emphasis on highlighting my technical skills and my project section and, you know, really talking about it in and communicating clearly about what I learned, how I did it, everything so that employers know my technical abilities. I remember we were talking and I, like, I, I don't remember what I was talking about, but Rick just stopped and in the middle of the conversation was like, do you, any, do you play any games? And he asked like, what's your favorite game? And you know, I, I told him like, I really, really love Pokemon. <laughs> And I just, I didn't really expect him to relate to that because, you know, the people that like Pokemon really like Pokemon. And then there are just a lot of people where Pokemon is like, just not on their radar at all. So I didn't like expect anything, but he was like, oh, I love Pokemon. I love Pokemon too. And then um, he was telling me about his like first project was making a battle simulator for Pokemon, so that was really cool. Um, a cool example of like how you can mesh your interests with data science. I think from that point on, I was more comfortable with him. Every time I would get insecure or I would feel like, you know, like I'm really stuck on some problem or I don't know if I can finish my capstone project or something like that. He was really quick to remind me each time of like, you have so many good qualities about you and so many strengths and that like you know you should really focus on that and like those are the things that really come through to people especially in the workplace so yeah having that sort of reassurance and support was really nice mm -hmm.